So you've configured your NDTC and now you're about ready to create schedules. But before you get to the point of creating schedules, you want to also go about to configure the devices that are connected to this NDTC to ensure that they truly are tracking the proper channels so that when it is that you're, doing, you're creating the schedules, you are truly seeing the effects that you are looking for in the spaces. So to do that, we are going to go ahead and actually configure our output devices in such a way that they reflect accordingly. So by that, we can, we'll have to log in, and again, the pin in this device specifically is 123456, and one can tell that we're logged in by the, the available navigations that are, avail that are shown as the footer for the dashboards as well. So by that, we can then go through and select to go under technician mode, and under technician mode, we have a specific section set up for output device configuration. So from here, you can tap under output devices, and that is going to give you a list of all of the output devices that are currently connected to this NDTC. And so for example, on this NDTC, we have a luminaire, an embedded luminaire that does CCT. So by then, I can navigate into this luminaire. And one thing you should be able to note is, this CCT luminaire actually holds two poles. One pole is for the intensity, and the second pole is for the Kelvin temperature. And so by that, I can come about to modify what specific channels it is that the intensity is tracking. And I can also go about to determine what specific channels it is that the Kelvin temperature is also tracking. So by here, I can come through, and as a point of mark as well, that a pole or an output device, an output device with its, its poles, can actually track multiple channels simultaneously. So unlike an input device, in which an input device can only broadcast to one specific channel, an output device can actually track multiple channels simultaneously. So I can have it be, for example, that this particular device can track, or this pole can track other channels, or channel three, channel four, channel five, and these are switch channels, I can also go under the occupancy channels and make such a way as well for them to track channel occupancy channel three, channel four, and channel five. And I can also do the same thing as well for the photo, for the, for the photo cell channels accordingly as well. When done with this, I can come back. And if it comes in that I want to rename the occupancy sensor, or sorry, if I want to rename the device, I can also tap back here and associate any name that I would like to set onto it as well. The maximum word length is 20 characters. And if I come back again, and when it comes to the CCT poll, right now the CCT poll is only tracking channel two. I can also modify it to track any other channels. And that flexibility, I leave it much more so, well, you would, we would leave it much more so towards you. One key thing to also note, is that the CCT pole does not have the ability to actually, um, to actually track occupancy channels, nor does it have the ability to track photo cell channels as well. And that's why if you were to scroll across all of this, you'll note that neither the occupancy nor photo cell channels have been associated with this particular Neo CCT and associated to pole two of, ne of this Neo CCT as well. So by that, we have updated the settings for the Neo CCT. By going back, we are pushing these settings accordingly. One also has the ability to go through and configure other outputs as well. Let's say, for example, an NPP16. I can identify this NPP16 by tapping onto the, identi the identify button. What you should note is you should hear relays clicking. And that relay clicking is the relay pertaining to this particular NPP16. So I can also come back in again and also associate which switch channel this occupancy sensor is, so this NPP16 is tracking, which occupancy channel this NPP16 is tracking, as well as which photo cell channels this NPP16 is tracking or are tracking, is tracking. And by that, you can do this and continue across all of the output devices that are connected to this, N, to this NTT, NDTC. Let's go back. And we are back to the home screen.